I hatched best tech world's egg for 10 days, and in this video, you will see what I hatched, how many of each pet I hatched, and of course how many and which huge pets I got. Here it is. The egg number 212, or also called Void Spiral Egg, which is the last egg of tech world. The next permanent egg will only be in world 3, and who knows when that will be out. Just gotta wait till then. For hatching, I got a few game passes, such as Magic Eggs and Huge Hunter. I also got Pet Mastery, which gives a bit of extra chances to hatch Golden and Rainbow Pets, and of course Egg Mastery, which by now I have maxed out. As of Enchants, I used two Huge Hunters, one Shiny Hunter and three Lucky Eggs. One of them is level 8, and two other are level 7. I think I got enough boosts for hatching. Here are the pets I have before hatching. Just a quick look on all of the pets from the egg so that we can compare before and after hatching. I have no rainbow or golden black hole Angelus yet. Wonder how many I will hatch and also how many huge pets I will hatch. Let's use a few potions and start to hatch. Now that we got weekly updates, I will have to skip a few days between the 10 days so that I can make other videos too. So day one of hatching. And so far I hatched around 1.5 millions of eggs, which I think is a pretty good start. I did not get any huge pet yet, but I did get a rainbow black hole Angelus which is good as it will help me to grind coins faster because all of my huge pets now got stronger. Other than that, don't think I got anything interesting. We got huge kangaroo as active huge pet. This is a new one and hopefully I can hatch it in this video. I decided to do a little test and see how fast I can get coins with all of the boosts with this team in breaking breakables very fast. In just like four minutes, I was able to get a third of coin cap, which is really fast. I can definitely reach coin cap from zero in just like 20 minutes, which is kind of crazy, not gonna lie. It's day two now, in total hatched around three millions of eggs so far. Let's see if I got anything good. Well, I did not get a huge pet, and overall, I kinda got nothing interesting at all. Even with a lot of eggs being hatched, this day doesn't seem to be interesting at all as of the hatches, just many random pets. Let me craft some more tier four potions because I like using them for hatching. I still got a chance to get the kangaroo, so let's continue to hatch and see if I can get one. Day three of hatching, and let's see if the results are better this time. No huge pet again, but at least this time, I got a golden black hole Angelus, which is a new pet in my inventory. So that's something positive for this day. And we got the huge kangaroo again, so that's two more days to have a chance of hatching it. Let's see if I can get it this time. Now back to hatching. Day four. We are almost halfway through the 10 days already. Over 5 millions of eggs were hatched in total. Let's see if anything interesting appeared in my inventory. No huge pets, no rainbow black hole Angeluses, but a golden, and few normal did appear and don't know what else because the rest of the pets are a lot easier to hatch and more of them appear in my inventory. Like I almost got 4 millions of normal wireframe dogs, and like 1.5 millions of normal wireframe cats. And look at that. An update coming out soon, which will add the backrooms event to the game. Anyway, let's continue to hatch. The huge party we got right now might help me. Day five. And now we got the backrooms event here. I didn't really try to hatch there yet, just a little bit. I will hatch later for other hatching video, but right now I'll focus on tech world's egg. This time, I actually hatched a huge, the huge elephant. And I also got the hatch recorded, which means I can show you the hatch in a bit. The huge party did indeed help me to get the first huge pet of the video. You can see a few of Backroom's pets in my inventory, but just ignore them, I guess. Here's the huge elephant hatch. Not a new huge, sadly, but a huge pet is a huge pet. So I'll take it. Better than nothing for sure. Make sure to subscribe to not miss more hatching videos, as usually I do catch the huge pet hatches to show them to you in the hatching videos like this. But anyway, let's just continue to hatch, I guess. We are halfway through and got the first huge pet. Pretty good day. It's day six of hatching the best tech world's egg. Around 7.6 millions of eggs were hatched so far. Let's see if I got anything cool, and look at that, I got a rainbow huge fluffy cat. I definitely did not expect to hatch a rainbow huge basically a day after hatching a normal huge. That was pretty lucky. But I got the hatch exactly when I stopped recording for 20 or 30 minutes, 
It's like if the game knew I wasn't recording and decided to give me this huge pet. Anyway, besides that, I pretty much haven't hatched anything interesting. I still only got one rainbow black hole Angelus somehow. So I'll leave for like two days and do a backrooms egg hatching video, which is now out on my channel. And after that, I will continue to hatch Tech World Egg again. I'm back from back rooms to Tech World, and now it's day seven of hatching. Now I got even more backroom pets here from that backrooms egg hatching video, and I got my second rainbow black hole Angelus finally after this long. I think it took me over seven millions of eggs to get it, which is crazy. Besides that, nothing really interesting. And apparently I got over a million of rainbow wireframe dogs. I got three more days left to hatch, so maybe I can hatch another huge pet? Let's see if my luck is good enough for that. Eighth day of hatching, and now I have hatched over 10 millions of eggs. No new huge pets have been hatched, sadly. And again, nothing really interesting overall. No luck lately at all, pretty much. Let's just use some potions and continue to hatch, I guess. It's the ninth day of hatching, getting close to the final day. I still got only these two huge pets hatched, but this time I at least got two more rainbow black hole Angeluses, so this time I at least got something better. I got over seven millions of the wireframe dogs now can be useful for the pet mastery. So I decided to try and grind some coins to see how fast I can do it now, because now my best pet is a backrooms pet and not the black hole Angelus, and as you can see it's pretty fast anyway, let's get to the final day. And the finale. Tenth day of hatching best tech world's egg. I hatched 12.8 millions of eggs in total in those days, which is pretty good I would say. No new huge pets have been hatched, but I did get another two rainbow black hole Angeluses. I got many pets, but let's take a closer look on how many of each pet I actually got. Starting with the most common pet, Wireframe Dog. I hatched around 6.49 millions normal, around 31.3 thousands shiny, around 1.28 millions golden, around 6.2 thousands shiny golden, around 1.27 millions rainbow, and around 6.1 thousand shiny rainbow. That is a lot of wireframe dogs in total that's a little over 10 millions of wireframe dogs. Another easy pet, the wireframe cat. I hatched around 2.58 millions normal, around 12.3 thousand shiny, around 509 thousand golden, around 2.4 thousand shiny golden, around 502 thousand rainbow, and around 2.4 thousand shiny rainbow and those were the two common pets. Now getting to rarer pets, starting with Void Alien. I hatched around 1.84 thousands normal, seven shiny, 341 golden, and 335 rainbow. Now this was a big jump from millions to thousands. No shiny golden or shiny rainbow this time either. And finally, the Black Hole Angelus. I hatched 35 normal, six golden, and six rainbow. Getting a shiny of this is super hard, only if you are lucky enough. And of course, these two huge pets. One of them is Rainbow, which is basically worth like three normal ones according to rap, I guess. I do like that. Time to equip a lot of different pets to see how cool it will look. Here's 80 normal void aliens, and they are all watching. Now 80 golden ones, and those are super bright for some reason. What's worse, light mode or 80 golden void aliens? If normal looked boring and golden too bright, rainbow ones look really cool, not gonna lie. The original white color now glows every color of rainbow, and it looks really cool on those void aliens. And let's continue with the cool-looking pets. Here's 41 Black Hole Angeluses. One of the best-looking pets in Pet Simulator 99, and you probably would agree. Hopefully we can get a huge version of this someday, because I would want to hatch for it. Now the golden version, here I got six golden black hole Angeluses, and golden does look nice, but normal definitely looks better, but that doesn't mean it looks bad, right? Rainbow void aliens looked cool, but rainbow black hole Angeluses look kind of bad, I'm gonna be honest. I feel like the changing colors animation for this pet doesn't suit it at all. What do you think? But now, let's actually get to the huge pets. Starting with this huge elephant, it's a decent looking huge pet, I would say, but one of the cheapest huge pets you can find, sometimes even having wrap a bit below the huge happy rock and computer. And this wasn't my first elephant. It was my third huge elephant, as you probably could see in my inventory. And this is the best pet I got in this video, huge rainbow fluffy cat. 
Remember the way void aliens were glowing rainbow? Fluffy Cat as a rainbow version does it even better, not gonna lie. I really like the way it changes colors. What would you rate the rainbow version at? I would say probably like 9 out of 10. Rainbow makes this huge look cooler. I did hatch three normal fluffy cats before already. So now I got four fluffy cats as a team, and one of them is Rainbow. And you can see the difference between normal and rainbow. It definitely looks cooler and more fun. So the results of these 10 days are pretty good, I would say. The rainbow huge fluffy cat definitely makes the results look a lot better. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Me and YouTube thinks you might like one of these videos, so make sure to check if that's true. Join my Discord server with link in description, and I will see you soon.